one come up? You want to come up? All right. Come on, come on, come on. You got it. You got it. You got it. Yeah. We are going to have a fun day today. Yeah. Put your seatbelt on. Seatbelt on. Then let's get going. I'm just gonna take this off. <laughs> Learning how to do this one handed. What? <laughs> Over the next month, Hawa Homes on Wheels Alliance.org is sponsoring a bring your own van build, um, which is to help nomads who are out here who have cars and don't have the extra financial little cushion there to be able to make it a little bit more comfortable like for beds um, maybe a roof fan small solar system shelves for cooking kind of that kind of stuff and so that is the focus of uh, the month of the van build I volunteered to be on the construction crew and I'm not going to actually be working having my tools out for um, hmm, a couple of uh, weeks actually good grief yeah a couple of weeks today is the setup though so I am getting ready to go over there and see what I can do to help and then I am I've got some other things planned but I don't want to overwhelm you because <laughs> and it really I have lots of open time and I travel and I bustle a lot I like to call it bustling instead of busy because I'm liking what I'm doing and I only really have things planned for the next month and then it's kind of nebulous after that I've got some things in the you know whatever but uh, it's unfolding for me just the way it's unfolding for you as you watch these videos so without further ado let's start her up and get on the road this is how organized Homes on Wheels Alliance is where are we going Look at this hill, we gotta go up. Oh yeah, let's do it. Oh yeah, we got a lot of practice in Mexico for that one. <laughs> All right, Homes on Wheels Alliance. Not only do they tell you where the grocery stores are, they tell you where the dump is. And this is all free. Yeah, it's super busy here. I guess it's because it's Saturday morning. I don't know where to go. Yes, I'm just gonna, I guess you just gotta be bold around here. It's gotta be bold. He goes forward, I'm gonna back up. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, really, this is good uh, awareness and attention because, uh, wow, we are trashy people. You don't have to let her in. Do I, 
Do you mind if I videotape you? Oh, no. Not a Imogene. Imogene figuring out my dog door. And while I'm here, How many shoes do you have by your front door? There's a bit of wind out here this morning, so this is the experiment for the microphone. <laughs> and I've kind of grown attached to having my keys attached to me. And now <laughs> this microphone, I feel like <laughs> I'm, I'm not wearing earrings anymore, so. <laughs> okay, so what does this mean? our door open. Hey Rose, are you busy? Um, I'm uh, exper I don't have the camera on you but I am filming oh, okay. <laughs> because uh, I'm experimenting with microphones. Oh okay. Uh, first let me try to get my dog to stop barking. <laughs> hey, go lay down. I'll be right there. I'll be right there okay. Thank you. I'll be right there. We'll see if that works. Um, anyway, I'm experimenting with microphones. Okay. So you have a few different ones there that you're trying out? Oh, no. These are my keys. Oh. 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 <laughs> microphone. This is a mic. No, I have one microphone. Oh, okay. I thought you were going to try this one. Well, I've, I have been trying. Oh, you know, okay. I did my ear pods and yeah. So now I'm at, you know, now this is the next <laughs> Look so, at that. So, so proud to be part of you. Part of she you. is, you know, that was a first. This is new. Oh, what okay. I really am always going to like about you is your name. <laughs> because that was a contender for our, our daughter's name. Okay. Yeah. So to, to, you know, to be able to say those words is... <laughs> but I like you for other reasons, too. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for recognizing that. <laughs> hey, you know, I have, a, I have a saying, you spot it, you got it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, so. Somebody brought, found some yellow flowers growing around here. And that shell was right beside my van in the sand. Baja. Isn't that beautiful? That coral, that is from the Pelican Walk. So I'm just loving what that looks like. We're getting ready to do Imogene's afternoon walk here. I'm starting to get a whole bunch of stuff hanging off of me. <laughs> this is her leash. Of course, I got my keys because I never leave my van unlocked. It's just a habit. That way I don't ever have to think, is my van locked? Because I lock it every time. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, next, binoculars. I have been trying to remember to bring these binoculars for a long time now. 
and today was the day. I got my binoculars. Microphone. The microphone did not, it does not work very well. In wind, it's better than nothing. Wait a minute, I gotta get Imogene out of the trash. Get out of the trash, get out of the trash. Out, 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 out. Maybe we ought to start walking, but <clears throat> let me just finish this thought, hopefully. Of course, what was the thought? <laughs> Microphones, microphones. We're going to figure it out. But um, I know there was a little windscreen sock thing that went on top of this, but I cannot find it. So I got to run across it. I know it'll turn up, but I don't have it now. But I think this is better than nothing. So let's head out on our walk. You know, you're so little compared to... I, I can't even, this camera does not even begin to it does not even begin to address the majesty and the vastness that it feels to be standing out here. I think we found a geocache here. Just kind of sitting in a bush back to 2016. It was just rolled up. Fed it in like a landscape tie. And I don't have a pen, so I can't add my name to it. It's just right in this cactus. special note of that purple pouch on the countertop there and now look at who could not think of anything else except for that pouch on that countertop <laughs> she was just sitting on the top of this but of course I didn't catch that but uh, I've gotten out the treats again because we are the uh, skills that we're working on now is coming as soon as I say she hears my voice and she knows that I am looking for her. That's the first thing. And the second thing is barking. That when she barks, it's you know it's not that I don't want her to bark because that she's my early warning system. Um, I just want her to stop when, I want her to. So that is the situation. Yeah, you know, she'll stop what she's doing and return to me. And she will stop barking and look at me and wait for further instructions. Yeah, and then life will be perfect. Hello, my friend. Passing through. As of tomorrow, I've been here for a week and it's been wonderful. I, I, I miss the feeling of living on a street with neighbors that you kind of know just by walking down the sidewalk and saying hi and having porch talks and things like that. I've been at this desert and part of a little neighborhood for the past week and every evening I walk every evening and uh, most mornings um, every evening that's really when I feel the most social is uh, you know just walking in a jean and have a little chit chat with my neighbors it's been it's been it's been really really great Imogene and I are getting ready to go to game night. 
What she's trying to tell me is we usually go for a poop walk about this time. But I have a feeling when I go over there, there's going to be a lot of milling around and all before, you know, before things get dialed in. And so we'll take a little walk then, okay? Is that a right? Is that a right, love, love? What do you think? All right, let's go. This is Amy. She's an angel. And I know an angel when I meet one. The first of many difficult decisions she made was to allow us to rip out her back seat, and it was quite the project. Oh, this is video. Do uh, you want video? Oh, that's okay. Oh, yeah. So, Anya, what was it like to work with me? <laughs> <laughs> Enough about you. <laughs> your ideas, um, you think out of the box like I do, you know, you're okay to think about color now the lines or whatever like that. then you know um, when we actually got it we were doing what we were learning but then we were adding our own 
mm -hmm. unique things mm -hmm. based on just all the talks we have. So, I, I mean, I could have asked for a better partner oh, in this. So, yeah. And I didn't. You just arrived. So. Yeah. Oh, thank you so much. Um, and yeah, I felt really, it was really nice. I felt very heard by you. Um, I felt very listened to and, and received um, in my thoughts, which made me feel very, um, yeah, like I was, like we were working together we were. and that was really, really nice. And I felt really comfortable being like, Diane, this is you. <laughs> yes, yeah, right. I'm tapped. Yeah, I'm tapping yeah. out and this is, so I felt yeah. that worked out really well. That's how dancing works, you know? Yeah. <laughs> just kind of hand our, you know, hand off the time. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it was really fun now and there's more. Just a couple days on Thursday, we're gonna go to bed in. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Howa, for pairing us. Yes, mm -hmm. thank you, Howa. <laughs> Solid level floor, and we even engineered a removable hatch for to, to replace the fuel filter. So it's onward. The next project is a bed. like to say on you. I'm at a loss for <laughs> words. I think we've decided that <laughs> this is the best part. Let's just do it. Diane is an evil genius. I'm a loving genius, I'll have you know. I am not evil. We finished a little early and uh, what that signals to me is let's get out the paints and as soon as I said that everybody started pulling out our paints it ended up being displayed at the closing party and uh, everybody autographed it so Amy is going to be wherever she goes be cradled in the warm embrace and love and best wishes of all of us Oh, uh, we're hungry. Go <laughs> <laughs> get food. Okay. During the months of March and April, I had a number of opportunities to practice speaking my truth and being honest where it might possibly hurt feelings um, or my feelings get hurt. Um, and in retrospect, I have to say that I am excited for what's next.